English online class. So children, in last class, we were discussing about the lesson, third lesson, the most beautiful thing. So, in today's class, we will discuss further story. So, let's begin today's class. All of you, open your English textbook and open page number 27. So, children, before starting today's class, let us revise the lesson once. So, children, it is a story of a queen. The queen was bored in her palace. So, what do you mean by palace, children? Yes, you are right. Palace means big, a big bungalow where king and queen live. So, children, in their palace, many servants will be there, good dishes, good food. So, whatever they need, everything will be there in their palace. So, children, one day the queen announced that she was bored. So, her advisor came there and he asked her, Would you like to hear some music? Ever majesty. So the word majesty and highness are the different ways of addressing a king or queen. So what do you mean by advisor? Advisor is a person who guides someone and tells them what to do in difficult times. So children, when advisor asked some music giver majesty, the queen gave a slight note S. Then advisor called the court musicians. When they started playing the same old songs, she sent them up. The poor advisor Try everything to satisfy the queen. So he called court acrobats. So what do you mean by acrobats? Acrobats means people who are good at stunts, jumping, balancing and so on. Then portraits were ordered. So, what do you mean by portraits, children? Portraits means picture of a person, usually the face. So, what happened, children? Then also, she was feeling bored. So, she says, I am tired of this. And she says, I need something a different, something unique. I need a different sort of beauty. So, she announced to inform everyone that the queen is holding a contest. Contest means competition for the most beautiful thing in the world. So, whoever brings the most beautiful thing in the world they will be rewarded with the crown of queen. Now let's see what happens next. Her staff gasped. The queen's crown was pure gold studded with magnificent gems. There was no treasure like it in whole country. So children, when queen announced to inform everyone that the queen is holding a competition for the most beautiful thing and also she told that whoever brings the most beautiful thing, they will be rewarded with her crown. 
So after hearing that, her staff gasped. So what do you mean by gasped? Gasped means to look in a quick, short breath, except expressing surprise. So they were surprised after hearing the words of Queen. Because the queen's crown was pure gold studded. Studded means covered with magnificent gem. There was no treasure like in the country, whole country. So they were surprised with the words of queen. The announcement was made. Soon a long line of people formed. They showed their portrait, their paintings and even their animals. After several days, the queen was disappointed. So children, the announcement was made. After the announcement, soon a long line of people was formed in front of the palace. They showed their portrait and their paintings and even some of them showed their animals to the queen. But what happened? No one could make her happy. Still she was feeling bored. She was unhappy with them. So after several days, the queen was disappointed because she could not find the most beautiful thing. This is hopeless, she muttered. No, quite, not quite hopeless, even majesty. The queen sat up wondering who spoke. So children, she, she was disappointed. So, so, she talked to herself. This is hopeless. She muttered. So, muttered means complaint in a low voice as if talking to herself. Then, she heard a voice. Not quite hopeless, even majesty. The queen sat up and she was Wonder who spoke. A bearded man stood behind the palace guards. You can end your search now, your hands. So children, she heard, she saw a bearded man stood behind the palace guards. So he says, you can end your search now, your hands. So children, this is enough for today's class. In next class, we will discuss further story. Now let us move towards today's new words in this lesson. First one is contest. C-O-N-T-E-S-T. -E contest. Second one is beautiful. B -E Treasure. T R E A S U R E. 
E. Treasure. See you children. One more time I will repeat these words. First one is contest. Second one is beautiful. Third one is world. Fourth one is prize. Fifth one is crown. Sixth one is gas. Seventh one is study. Eighth one is magnificent. Ninth one is country. And tenth one is dredge. Okay children, it was all about today's class. Now let us move towards today's homework part. And today's homework is read and write each word five times. So children, you have to read and then you have to write these ten new words five times in your homework notebook. Okay children.